Hi Disney fans! I've been wanting to make this video for a few days because I am majorly excited because I've just had a delivery from Japan and it is my Beauty and the Beast two foofies so I can't wait to show them to you I'm so in love with them they're the most amazing foofies that they've ever brought out and I want to show them to you now so let's get stuck! So the foofies came in two different sizes they came in the micro size and they came in the smalls and the smalls are unscented and the, sorry the minis are unscented and the smalls are really really nicely scented so I'm going to show you all the smalls and then I'm going to show you all the, uh, the minis so let's start with Beast here he is and he has loads of detail kind of like um, the Samsung but he's got a lovely face and he's got this fur which is really really soft he's got his little outfit on he's got ears, he's got his horns he's got his hair that goes all the way down the back and he's got his ponytail with his bow in he's also got his little tail and he smells <laughs> really really nice so that's beast let me know what you think of him down in the comments. Next up we have Belle, and here she is. So quite similar to the Sun Sun Belle, but obviously she's got a bigger face, she's got blushing, she's got a bun, and I actually I prefer this bun to the Sun Sun bun. She's got a little dress, which is a separate piece. She's got hands, which is something a bit different to the Sun Sun. She's got a separate piece for her dress here. She's got a two little feet. And her hair at the back, which is attached. And her dress. And again, she smells absolutely gorgeous. And that's Belle. Next up we have Cogsworth. And I really love Cogsworth. He's got a really big face. He's actually got like a 3D nose. He's got these two bits at the top for the top of the clock. He's got two little hands which are sewn flat but are 3D. Obviously his pendulum which is sewn on. Two little feet. He's lovely and plump. Round the back. And he also smells the same which is absolutely lovely. Next up we have Lumiere, who um, to me kind of looks more like an egg and leg cup than a candle, <laughs> um, but here he is. I don't think we've ever managed to get him right. I don't think he was right in some, some form. I don't think he's quite right in his form either. But we've had a go. Right, he looks more like an egg cup. He throws flame. I don't think he's got his eyes right. And he's got his hands. I quite like the fact that they've sewn his hands in this position so it kind of gives him a gesture. And he's got detailing on his round base. And they all come with this nice little all foofy tag in the cloud. And again, he smells lovely as well. I just don't think he looks anything like Lumiere. Um, but like I said, they've never managed to get him right in some some form, and neither have they got him right in Ufufi form. So let me know down in the comments what do you think of him. Next up we have Mrs. Potts and Chip, and I can't um, really get across how nice these smell. They have such a pleasant smell. So this is Mrs. Potts, and I think they've done a really good job with her spout. And her top, she really looks like a teapot. She's got a handle. She looks so much more like a teapot than the Sunsun version of her ever did. Though I think she's she's come out much nicer as a new foofy. And the same with Chip. He looks like a a puffy cup. He's got his 
nose, handle, he's got his chip, and he's lovely and squishy. And yeah, I just, I think these two um, make great little foodies. So let me know what you thought of those down in the comments. So in addition to all the small sizes, they also brought out um, a micro pair of Beast and Belle, which comes on a cardboard base, which they are attached to. And they are just as cute as the larger versions. Same detailing, just in smaller form. About the size of an egg. And they are pretty much identical to the smalls. Same dress, same shoes, same detailing. Just in small form. And they're really cute! Let me know what you think of them down in the comments. And last but not least, we have the Mrs. Potts and Chip pair, um, which are not um, mini size. They are. Um, they, this is called a mini set, but they are a much larger scale. And obviously, Chip is now in scale with Mrs. Potts, who is much bigger than him. Unlike the first ones, where Mrs. Potts and Chip are the same size. So I'm not sure what they were going for with their scaling because as you can see Beast and Belle are tiny whereas the pair of Mrs. Potts and Chip are actually quite big. But they are absolutely lovely, they're so soft. She's got this lovely detailing. I think that's what I like about the Foofies as well, is that they've got detailing all the way around. Nice face, eyelashes, really nice um, spout, and everything is soft. Absolutely everything, even the top bit is all soft and squishy. Got the detail on the face, and they come attached to their base as well, which I quite like because then they'll always be okay. Let me know what that you think of them down in the comments. So here is the full set of smalls. So let me know which one is your favourite. I think um, my favourite is a toss up between Beast because he's so lovely and all the detail he's added and how he's given all his fur. And probably Mrs. Potts because she's just got so much more extra detail. Um, but I love them all. Um, Beauty and the Beast is my favourite Disney film. So when it comes to Beauty and the Beast, um, there was no question <laughs> for me that I was going to get these. So let me know down in the comments, are you going to get them? Do you love them as much as I do? Um, and what Ufufi sets are you hoping are going to be released now that Ufufis have come to the UK and the US? Because these are a Japan set at the minute. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And keep watching for my review of the Beauty and the Beast um, musical water globe that I've just received today as well. So check that one out as well. Bye!